And I'll give you one better. The Democrat Party has done more damage to this country than any of our foreign enemies ever could have. Think about that. The Democrat Party has managed to erode the trust and credibility in our justice system, the trust and credibility in our intel agencies, the trust and credibility in our health institutions, the trust and credibility in our elections. Every single institution that the Democrats have used in order to get Trump on this, this jihad that they've been on is now on the brink of collapse, is hanging over the cliff and Democrats are stepping on its fingers. Will they learn? Probably not, probably not. And so the American people, the sane rational ones are gonna have to sit on the sidelines and watch their country be destroyed while they pay for it. <laughs> it it's, it's unbelievable how we ended up in this situation. All Republicans did was just vote for Donald Trump in 2016. They didn't ask for all of this insanity. <laughs> they were given a candidate. They chose Donald Trump. They voted for Donald Trump. And because of that, they have to watch their country be turned to dust. Their institutions, they have to worry about what type of system, what type of government, what type of nation they're leaving their children and, the, and their, their grandchildren. And Democrats will say it's all worth it. For the Democrats that are cheering and supporting this, for the Democrats that are clapping like, like, uh, uh, laughing like hyenas at the notion that Donald Trump should have his properties seized by the state and sold, I have to ask you, when history writes about these days, you sure you're going to be on the right side? 